trouble. G.I. Joe is there. I hope the USS flag is ready for me to land. That was one heck of a mission. Oh, hey guys. I am that 80s nostalgic toy guy. Welcome back to the collector's table. Welcome back. You know, I'll never outgrow my love of my action figures, my toys, my collectibles, my statues, all of my displays. I will never grow tired of them. I will never grow old of them. And that is the case with my G.I. Joe collection. I absolutely love the G.I. Joe Real American Hero toy line. So you will see a lot of those videos on my channel. Yo, Joe! And I never, ever miss an opportunity to bring out one of my toys, one of my collectibles to help me introduce a video. So if you're following along on the series of videos I've done for my USS flag that I'm doing for my channel, you will have just finished watching the video where we took footage at the Museum of 20th Century Warfare at Fort Harrison State Park just outside of Indianapolis, Indiana. What an amazing tribute to our veterans. Now, this video you're gonna see has a little bit more to do with this Sky Striker here. This Sky Striker needs a place to land. Okay, Joe's back to the carrier. We've still got a job to do. And it's gonna land on this USS flag in the following video. I hope you enjoy this following video where we are still on location at the Museum of 20th Century Warfare and we are unboxing for the first time while it's been in my possession the USS Flag. Introducing the G.I. Joe USS Flag aircraft carrier. Imagine being on the deck of this aircraft carrier. The USS Flag is fantastic! It's so big! Let's head out there and see what this USS Flag looks like. We're going on a mission to the Museum of 20th Century Warfare. We'll see you out there. Yo, Joe! Now you see me? Now you don't! Hey guys and gals, it's that Ace and Celtic toy guy, and today it's video number two in my series of videos on this awesome G.I. Joe, a real American hero, USS flag. We're here on location on this Veterans Day weekend 2022 at the Fort Harrison State Park here in Indianapolis, Indiana, formerly the U.S. Army base from the early 1900s to the mid 1980s. That's right, this is the Museum of 20th Century Warfare. And we're here today to unbox the contents and just go over the contents of this USS flag, this G.I. Joe, a real American hero, USS flag. Yeah, yeah. G.I. Joe USS flag aircraft carrier comes with what you see here. Other figures and equipment sold separately from Hasbro. We're going to just unbox this thing, pull out all the parts. We want to make sure they're all here. Maybe have a little list here to run down what we have and what we should have. And if there's something missing, I'm going to cry. All right, so let's start unboxing this USS flag. This is my first time opening up this USS flag box. So just bear with me. Uh, this is exciting for me, and I'm going to be as gentle as possible pulling this thing out of the box. Bazooka, we need some support here. You got it. Oof. I'm going to go ahead and lay it down here because I got to pull this stuff out of here. So I'm going to go ahead and do that, pull everything out that I can to get on the table. We're going to start going over these parts of this USS flag. All right, guys and gals, we got box number one here. This is all original packaging, everything that came with this USS flag over 35 years ago. That's right, this thing is in very good condition. Let's go ahead and open this thing up and see what's inside. Oh my lord, look at this right here. We have these awesome ship deck pieces that are inside this box. I have never had one of these USS flags. I have never been up close and personal with unboxing one. This is my first time and to see and hold a USS flag piece in my hand, something that I only dreamt about for 35 years. It's just amazing to me. This thing has awesome, pristine stickers. And look at that right there. G.I. Joe, Yo Joe, a real American hero. G.I. Joe, Joe, Oh, wow. Now, I got this thing from Dallas Vintage Toys. Go ahead and check that first video out in this series of videos. I'll actually have a link inside this video uh, in the comment sections to go ahead and check out that first video. But they told me, Dallas Vintage Toys did, where I bought this from, they told me that these stickers were in awesome, immaculate shape and the piece itself is in awesome, immaculate shape. So far, I'm loving what I'm seeing. Look at those colors. 
The eye sees much, the mind fails to comprehend. And this thing is massive. I mean, look at this. This thing is huge. And we gotta add these other pieces onto this. Uh, I've only seen a USS flag on a couple displays in a couple vintage toy stores, but I really didn't get to mess around with it or touch it or be really, really close to it. So this is just like holding a holy grail to me. Before I move on any further, go ahead and hit the like on this video. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button if you haven't subscribed to the channel and hit that notification bell. That way you don't miss out on future USS Flag videos in this series of USS Flag videos. Don't miss out on those GI Joe videos or any of my videos in general. Thank you all for watching this video. Thank you all for doing everything you do to make my channel the success that it is. Well, thank you, sir. I'm gonna get this laid down flat on here and we're gonna get this cardboard box out of here and we're gonna see what the rest of the contents in this box are. This table that I have here is actually, I believe, close to seven feet tall, maybe a little bit short. And this thing right here is not even, even close to being put together and it's already encompassing this whole display table I have here. Uh, this thing right here is amazing. Let's get the other contents out of the box before I bid you adieu. G.I. Joe will return after these messages. All right, guys and gals, we have the last few pieces here of the actual ship deck the top part here, the runway part. And uh, man, this thing is gonna be massive in one of those future videos when we actually put this thing together and put it on display. But this right here is amazing. Wow. Moving on here, we got pieces of the tower and the below deck and other parts that attach to this USS flag to create that above deck and below deck look. This piece right here has the fully operational, unbroken, fully working door here to get to peer into that uh, below deck piece. I want everyone who actually knows every single part of this USS flag, first off, I wanna say, man, that's awesome. I'm wowed by the fact that you can soak up every piece of this and know the knowledge of those pieces. Guys and gals, this is the first one I've ever had in my hand, so forgive me if I miss step with the name of the pieces. I just know that there's pieces that are above deck in the tower, there's below deck pieces, there's areas where you can peer into the below deck there's subsections, substructures, top structures, tower structures. There's a lot to go over with this thing. So please forgive me if I mess up on a word or a piece on this USS flag. I am extremely excited just to get this thing out of the box. This is just like cleaning a stable back home. So then we have this top part piece right here. And everyone knows where that piece is there. We have the piece right here that has those missiles there, and those missiles are inside this box. This right here is a complete USS flag. Guys, we're about halfway done here. I've got a lot of other small parts and pieces to pull out before we're done with this video. We have more of the below deck and structure and substructure, maybe some top structure pieces here uh, that are gonna go together and form this complete USS flag. We're gonna go ahead and set those off to the side. All right, guys and gals, we have some more pieces. This is flag that makes it stand nearly three and a half feet tall. Uh, this is just awesome and just in great shape. Uh, so far, the guys and gals there at Dallas Vintage Toys, they did not do me wrong. They did me amazing so far. This looks awesome. So we're gonna go ahead and set this piece down right there. We're gonna go ahead and look at this right here. We see we have another one of those fully functioning doors that we can open up and set up little scenes inside uh, part of this USS flag. Let's set these down and keep going over this. Now, back to G.I. Joe. We have some more uh, decking pieces here. We're gonna go ahead and set this down, just overlooking it, and it just all looks like it's all in great shape, nothing missing. All right, so we got this stuff packaged up really nice in bubble wrap. That's how they, uh, they packaged it up for me. I'm not gonna unwrap everything that's in bubble wrap, okay? I'm just here on location. I wanna pay tribute to our veterans. I wanna pay tribute and celebrate our love of G.I. Joe, a real American hero our love of the USS flag, the lore of this awesome, massive aircraft carrier. It's just amazing. Actually, I'm not even mad. That's amazing. Just wanted to look over these little pieces here that do that make up like the antenna or the radar system there on this thing. All these pieces that are with this are 100% complete and awesome. They are in great shape. So that's just one of the pieces. I'm not gonna take them all out of there. Like I said, bear with me and just understand that I'm not gonna take everything out of bubble wrap, I just wanna go over the pieces. We have all the cross pieces and support pieces that go below deck here that help support and make up the structure of this USS flag. They're all in here and they look to be in absolutely awesome shape. Nothing broken off of them. 
if you have one of these, you know that these little tabs and these things that hook on to the USS Flag deck and other parts, they break off very easily, especially over 35 years. Uh, they just wear down. Uh, these are in perfect shape. This thing, I don't believe, was ever really put together. All right, that last remaining uh, piece that goes on the bottom of this USS Flag right there, and it is all the way together and looks to be in complete great shape. There are still about five or six baggies of things to go over here. I'm not gonna pull everything out of the baggies, but I'm just gonna kind of hold them up. We're gonna go over what's inside of them, including one of my friends in there. I see him, one of my friends in there. Who is that friend? That's right, we have this awesome, with card and weapon complete, Admiral Kill Hall. Where's the Admiral? He's at the wheel. And there he is with this little weapon floating around inside there. And that file card that Dallas Vintage Toys gave me is absolutely, like, almost immaculate. It's got really sharp edges and uh, just, just amazing. Thank you, Dallas Vintage Toys. All right, hey everyone. Uh, Sean Ninus, owner of Dallas Vintage Toys. We're always buying toys, so we hope to hear from you all soon. Before I put Admiral Kill Hall back in this baggie, I'm gonna kind of do a little, little pirouette here, a little turnaround of this baggie right here. We see we have a lot of the structures that go on top of the deck, on top of this USS flag, including the rest of the antenna radar uh, satellite section. It's got tons of little small parts and pieces. I don't want to lose them, so that's why I'm only kind of going through the stuff as we look through the bag. But this is a 100% complete USS flag. I, I see no pieces missing uh, from looking down the checklist and everything that's in here. I just can't wait for that future video to put this thing together. I am running out of room here, and I hope that I could safely get this thing packaged back up to get it back home. But I want it so badly for the veterans and for the love of G.I. Joe to get out here and go over this USS flag. We've only got a few more baggies to go and we'll be done and I'll bid you adieu until the next video. All right, we have got another baggie here of really small parts. Now these small parts, I know if I undid them, I would I would lose them. I'm just a klutz, ask my wife. She will not be bashful, she will tell you. <laughs> and we got some more little pieces and everything that attach to this USS flag in that baggie. All right, guys and gals. Now, if you know the USS flag, if you, if you look at the box art, you'll know what these pieces right here are. It's the yellow vehicle and that little toe behind that are on the USS flag. We will definitely go over this in detail when we put this thing together. It's got all the stickers on there. The stickers do say flammable on there, so there is something explosive within this green piece right here. All right, guys and gals, you know what those are. Those are, like I promised, the missiles and the other parts and pieces to the tower and part of the deck that go on top of this USS flag. And those missiles go right inside this launcher right here. They are all in there and they all look to be in just pristine shape. This is just an amazing piece. We have a couple other attachments that go on top of this deck of this USS flag right in there. All right, guys and gals, before I bid you adieu, there's one more awesome thing to go through with the unpackaging and go through of this USS flag. The second video in the series of USS flag videos I'm doing for my channel, that one last piece, that awesome piece. You drove your family nuts with it. If you had it, you drove your friends nuts with it if they had it. It is a working and in awesome mint shape here. I mean, almost unplayed with shape. The electronic sound system with microphone there that comes with the USS flag. I cannot wait for the next video because I'm telling you what, we're gonna test this thing out in the next video. Some assembly required. And with that, that is it. This is the USS flag. This is all the parts and pieces that make up that seven and a half foot long USS flag, three and a half feet tall, three plus feet wide, USS flag, G.I. Joe, a real American hero. Now we know. And knowing is half the battle. G.I. Joe check out my other videos in the series of USS Flag videos. I'm thinking about doing a couple more. The next one, we're gonna have a lot of fun with this back at the house. I am that 80s nostalgic toy guy. This has been the very nostalgic USS Flag unboxing and go over video. This thing's huge. I'm gonna go ahead and take an hour to an hour and a half to package this thing up very carefully 
get it back in the SUV and get it back home for the next video. Go ahead and hit that like button on this video for me, please. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't subscribed to the channel and go ahead and hit that notification bell. That way you don't miss out on any future G.I. Joe, Real American Hero videos, USS Flag videos, and just all my videos in general. All right, guys and gals, that was the third video in my series of videos I'm doing on the USS Flag. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you liked what I did out there. As always, let me know what you thought about these previous uh, USS Flag videos in the comments section. I am that Asian Nostalgia Toy Guy. Thank you very much for watching. I look forward to getting back to the collector's table real soon to unbox something awesome, something cool, something old, or something new. Ace and I are saying goodbye. He's got to go to the Sky Striker for another mission, and I've got to get ready for another video. We'll see you back at the collector's table real soon.